Hello, uh, super quick little intro, but I just parked at the tattoo shop that I'm going to to get this tattoo done and I'm really excited. Um, this is going to be my first color tattoo and today we are just doing the line work and we're going to do uh, the actual color and filling it in, um, you know, at the next session, whenever the lines heal, I assume. Um, but yeah, I'm getting Jinx tattooed on my leg! Oh, I'm so excited! Um, yeah, I'll record some of the process, make it a little vlog, but um, yeah, uh, I gotta go run in because I'm a little bit late, but um, yeah, I'm really excited. Say goodbye to this bare leg. Nice. Okay, I'm gonna go. Yeah, I'm really excited. Oh boy. <laughs> It'll be interesting to see like my focused face. <laughs> Oof, that is a little spicy. <laughs> Okay. Um, and then I'll uh, keep working on it. Mm -hmm. I'm also gonna get another. Mm -hmm. I love that song. <laughs>
Man, towards the top, it also gets a little spicy again. <laughs> Wait, is this a remade Smooth Criminal? <laughs> what? That's so funny. <laughs> I was like, Ant Farm? That's, that's Michael Jackson. <laughs> Cold, it feels so nice on a fresh tattoo. <laughs> Yeah, I think I think the most I've had it on is for three days. Also, it just I, I don't know. Yeah. I just don't feel like leaving it on for that long. It's like too nasty. Like, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep. I think I'll be fine with just the three or four days. session is done yay it looks so good i'm so excited oh my god but yeah we did the line work today and then i'm coming back in like three weeks um to get the color and like get it filled in and everything and you know actually finish the tattoo but uh yeah i just got out of uh this session it took like two hours um i was uh, a little surprised or i guess not really surprised necessarily but it hurt a little bit more than I expected it to, um, but I guess it makes sense because I I haven't really had any other um, leg tattoos besides like the one on my thigh that she did, and that one is a much softer area, so it's uh, not as painful. And then my very first two tattoos were on my like the front of my legs, like uh, not where the ankle is, but like in the front, and that was a little bit painful. But the tattoos are small, so it really wasn't that big a deal uh yeah this was a little bit spicy but um it's okay it's i it's fine i can handle it um i uh i sit like a trooper <laughs> yeah i'm really excited uh so i guess uh i will finish this vlog in three weeks <laughs> um yay i'm so excited okay bye
Okay, hi, it's Thursday now. I got the tattoo on Monday, so I'm gonna peel. Uh, Devin's talking in the background about cooking. Anyway, I'm gonna peel the um, Sandy Derm thing or whatever from my tattoo now. Trying not to show my coochie here. <sighs> okay. <laughs> I just got back from from a gig that was honestly kind of annoying, but I'm Maybe happy you to be home. Put some pants on. Maybe you should uh, mind your business, bro. <laughs> wow. It's honestly not so bad back here, but towards the front where my fucking bone is, it's not pleasant. <laughs> oh, and towards the bottom. <sighs> Might be hair though. Mmm, sexy. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Okay, nice. Now I gotta wash her and moisturize her and um, let, let her heal. Yee. Oh my god, I'm still blown away by this camera quality. Um, okay, so I just parked at the tattoo shop, so I wanna go get that done but um just really quick uh clip before that i guess um yeah it's been a little bit over a month now we actually have to reschedule once the outline is fully healed now so we're gonna be working on nice healed skin and um yeah i'm honestly a little bit nervous because the outline kind of hurt more than i expected it to but I feel like maybe the blending and like the shading and all that stuff is gonna um, hurt less. I don't know. We'll see. But yeah, I'm here. I'm gonna go get this tattoo finished up. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Wish me luck. We here. <laughs> Look at all the pretty colors. I love the the caps or whatever are all different too. Oh, thank you. I kind of made it in the shape of a tree. Oh, it's hard to tell from here. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Yee! tattooers on TikTok who are just like posting every day and I'm just kind of like that's awesome but it's just so much work yeah dude I feel like TikTok especially is so daunting because it's short videos and you have to like cram as much shit as you can in there right I'll post a TikTok here and there and I'm like cool yeah. here's my thing um I'm mostly just here for memes and art <laughs> yeah like Here's my, uh, bugs in my tattoos. <laughs> I've been dreaming on in my head like I've seen it. A life worth living is a life with meaning. I'll do what I love till my heart stops beating. I'm feeding this demon. Got a taste and a waste bitterness. In my face, work a job every day till your dreams fade away. Like a card, never change. Play the game that we say. I need a break. Time to stay strong. Be to move on. Be what I want. I'll keep dreaming on. Time to stay strong. Be to move on. To be what I want. I'll keep dreaming.
face on when I chase like that. Yeah, I play so strong with the knife in the back. I'm a swing home run like a baseball bat. Gonna see me rise if you hate on that. I don't play both sides, there will be no cap. I'm a ride or die for my dreams on tap. I'm a fly real high, you ain't see me stack. No, it's not how you fall, it's how you get right back up. It's how you get tough. Calluses on my hands so rough, yeah, I call your bluff. I'm not the one. Mess with me, come down with none. Cause I'm so done, you had your fun. And now you gotta face down the barrel of the gun. Cause I got a full clip with your name on it. But I'm gonna let you side cause you ain't worth it. Time to stay strong, need to move on to be what I want, I'll keep dreaming on. Time to stay strong, need to move on to be what I want, I'll keep dreaming on. Hi, so we just finished uh, the tattoo and I'm about to head home, but I wanted to record this real quick. So it took a little bit over three hours, basically three hours, and um, it came out really well, by the way. I love it. It looks so good. Um, and I was um, sitting pretty well. The last like half hour was a little bit rough, so that was a little difficult, um, but it was fine. I got through it, um, it was just, yeah, there were some, some spart, sparts, some spots, especially, like, closer to the bone, to, like, you know, where the shin bone is, or whatever, uh, those were particularly, like, pinpointy kind of pain, um, so it was a little bit more rough, but, uh, overall, I mean, it wasn't that bad, like I said, it really was just, like, a little painful towards the end there. Because, yeah, you know, the skin's raw and we've been doing this for a few hours now. So I guess it makes sense. But now I kind of know my limit a little bit. I think I probably could have sat for like another hour. But yeah, I think four hours is probably like my tattoo limit right now. And uh, this was definitely the longest I've sat for any of my tattoos so far. So uh, moving up in the tattoo world, I guess. <laughs> yeah, it looks really good. Um, it stings, obviously. Now it's time to heal. But yeah, I'm really excited. I'm happy to show it off and it's gonna look really cool when it heals. And um, it's actually kind of frustrating because the camera, we were both taking pictures of it and um, the camera wasn't really picking up how bright the colors were. So um, that's a little annoying, but I mean, you can always kind of edit that afterwards, I guess. But uh, the camera can't even show you apparently how good it looks. That's how good it is, <laughs> um, but anyway. Yeah, I'm gonna stop rambling and go drive home now because it's a bit of a long drive. It's like a 50 minute drive to get here and you know go back. So I'm gonna go head out and um, do that now. So yeah, I will probably um, take some more updates before I actually edit this video. But yeah, otherwise, uh, thank you for watching. Um, this was my first like tattoo vlog video, I guess. So that's fun. And I want to do like a tattoo tour also because I did one like way like a while ago but I only had like a couple at the time and it really it's I don't even the video's not even up anymore so I really need to do another one because I have a lot more tattoos now but yeah okay I'm gonna go um we'll update you later <laughs> okay bye <laughs>
Hello, so um, I'm doing my outro and a final little update on this video. So I just pulled off the second piece of Saniderm that you saw me putting on in the last clip. I just pulled that off, uh, washed it again, and lotioned it. Uh, it was a little rough, <laughs> more rough, I would say this time pulling it off the second time than the first time because I think it already kind of started to like scab over but I mean the whole point of having it on is for it to like heal better and faster so I guess that makes sense but um, yeah it was really sticking to the skin it's all lotion now and um, now I just gotta let it heal so this tattoo took a total of like five hours um, which includes the first session of the outline which was just like two hours and then the second session took a little bit over three hours i'm definitely glad we split it up into two sessions it would have been too much i don't think i would have been able to handle it all in one session i do think it's kind of funny though that since this took uh, you know like a month to do uh both me and my tattoo artist have different hair colors by the end of this of course the um tattooed alt girls would have different hair colors a month later at, after the start of a vlog. <laughs> I'm really happy with how it came out. My tattoo artist is awesome. This is my fourth piece I think now from her and uh, I love her. I'm definitely gonna <laughs> keep going. But I actually asked her about this design because she drew it up herself. I asked her about it last time I was getting a tattoo and if anyone you know said they wanted it and she surprisingly said no and I was like what the heck but like you know Arcane the show recently came out I'm like I figured it would have gone like super quickly, but um, it didn't and she said yeah like um, I really want to do this tattoo so if no one claims it like I'll just do it for you basically. So it was also a free tattoo. I mean I tipped her. It wasn't technically free I guess but like I didn't have to you know. But just so you know if you're getting tattoos it is customary to tip the artist. And if you're getting a free tattoo, like if someone's practicing or something, or apprenticing, usually that's also what they'll do. They'll tell you the tattoo is free, but you have to pay tip. Theoretically, the tip is like up to you, um, but you can look up what the uh, normal rate is, I guess, depending on the tattoo. Um, <clears throat> I think it really varies. So I got an awesome free tattoo out of all this, and I love Jinx. If you don't know, I've also cosplayed her. I have a video of that on my channel also. Um, I do also plan on cosplaying the arcane version. Um, I made the costume myself, so yeah. Uh, I love Jinx. She's a crazy bitch. She's awesome. And I was actually thinking of possibly tattooing Delirium from Sandman on the other side of the leg, and that could be my crazy bitch leg. But let me just show you real quick what it looks like now, and then I will end the video. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try to get a good angle here for you to see because I'm basically recording upside down right now. But here is the completed tattoo. 
like I said, it just needs to heal, but yeah, this is it. It's so pretty, so bright, so colorful. I love it! Yay! But yeah, this was my first and only tattoo vlog on my channel so far, so that's exciting. I figured this would be a fun one to vlog about. Thank you for watching the video if you've gotten this far. Let me know if you liked it, if you want to see more kind of tattoo vlogs. I don't know if I'll want to do that every time I get a new tattoo, but we'll see. And you should definitely check out my artist. Her Instagram name is LydiaJ underscore art. She's really awesome and you should get a tattoo from her. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I do plan on doing an updated tattoo vlog. I already mentioned this earlier, but keep an eye out for that. As always, if you like this video, please leave me a like. And uh, if you aren't subscribed yet, I don't have a lot of tattoo content on here yet, but it's kind of a work in progress. Uh, but, you know, eventually there will be more. But I'm an artist also. I do all kinds of artsy things and fashion and all that. So if you like any of that, you should subscribe. And um, yeah, hope you have a great day and I will see you on the next video. Bye.